there but the nosy fox chair and draw a large curved line most of the way across the room. Next, what we're going to want to do is create a mirror or complementary line to complete the cigar shape. you're going to want to connect these two points with a semicircle. I'll show you why in a minute. To keep this shape symmetrical, you're going to want to give it little rubs. That can be easily done by making a diagonal line and then a line that follows this where the shape is going to be. Do that on the other side. these rudders back in with curved ones. Now I'm doing this while I'm talking and I'm from behind the camera, so it's not coming out as well as it ordinarily would. But you're getting the general idea. Next, let's place a little window up here in the nose cup so we know where the astronauts are going to be and so that they can look out into space. these windows on station square, just like in an airplane. Next, you can kind of color in the nose cone a little bit. Kind of put some little hash mark details right here on the rudder. I think that looks rather smart. Decorate this any way you want. You could draw a bird of prey or, I don't know, whatever symbol represents your country. For my country, it's a bird of prey. But because I can't really draw one right away, I'm going to make is the final pattern that we're going to form the window on. An easy way to do that is to make a large curved line on the top of the rocket that gets a little bit wider than the rocket, but that comes back and makes a point like that. Or scoops up a little like that. It will make a point because we're going to build off of that and finish a flame shape. We'll give it some depth, as well as giving the appearance that the end is very bright. And there we are. It's not the best spaceship, but it is our spaceship.